Yo, what's up YouTube? It's your boy Chaney Live coming at y'all with another vlog again. This vlog, man. This one right here, this is a good one. This one, man, this is for the ladies. Oh yes. Y'all say Chaney Live always talking about man this, man that. He don't care about us. He only make vlogs for them dudes. He don't care about the ladies. I love y'all. And because I love y'all, it's time for us to have real talk. We're going to keep it short and simple. This vlog, man, is to tell the ladies, all y'all, I don't care if you're short, tall, fat, skinny, pretty ugly, it don't matter to me. Okay, here's what you need to know. You need to know that the world has become a different place. Times have changed. The good old days are over. There is no more competition on who is the prettiest who has the biggest breast? Who has the biggest booty? Who has the roundest booty? Who has the roundest breast? Who has the longest hair? Who is the lighter complexion? All of that stuff. And who has the best makeup? All of that stuff, it's over. Hang it up. The world has changed. In our time that we live in today, there are men. That do makeup better than you. There are men that get surgeries and have better looking breasts than you. There are men that have rounder, get surgeries, okay? Don't get me twisted, don't get it twisted now. Okay, this is a message from a heterosexual man, all right? There are men that get surgeries and get rounder but than you can do makeup better than you can look prettier than you if that's what you're shooting for it's time to wake up ladies it's time to wake up the world has changed if you are a lady and you like heterosexual men. Okay. You want to know the truth. The truth is, we're not looking at the most prettiest woman. We're not looking at the woman with the longest hair. We're not looking at the woman with the best looking boobs. We're not looking at the woman with the best shaped ass. Not anymore, because there's too many imposters faking to be real women. Yeah, that's right. For a specific type of person, they're okay with that. That is still their preference. Okay? Once men have outdone women in makeup, in fashion, in boob jobs, booty jobs, body jobs, and all of that stuff, the heterosexual male of the day, it is, is not interested in those things anymore 
If your butt is too perfect, I'm going to be concerned. I'm going to be afraid to look at it. If your boobs are too well and evenly constructed, y'all women know what I'm talking about. They're the same size. Like, that's not real. Perfectly the same size. First of all, let me, let me, off the record, let's take this out. I don't like I don't I don't like fake boobs, man. They look uncomfortable as hell. Not uncomfortable for the person wearing them, but they look uncomfortable for the person that's supposed to enjoy them. Okay, they not they don't look soft. Okay, um, you know they just look uncomfortable as hell. All right, that's the truth. All right, so let's get back to the let's get back to the stay on script. Okay. And I ain't talking about script. This is all natural from the dome. I'm chaining it live because it's from the dome. Women. We don't want no fake stuff no more. It's over. The more wake the, you know, these men have mastered the makeup game. Okay? If I see a woman with a lot of makeup on and she looks beautiful I'm going to hesitate to, to, to look at her because I will not know if she is a real woman or if she is a man this has this is no jab at the LGB whatever it's called community this is no jab at homosexual men in any way Okay, this is not to offend anyone. This is to speak. I am speaking str uh, strategically and specifically from the opinion of a heterosexual male. I don't care if you got long hair, man. Stop putting fake hair in your head. It's beautiful women with short hair. My wife started her head all over it was gone started from scratch we rocked the same hairdo for a minute now it's all natural it's beautiful it's amazing that's just an example. No more fake eyebrows, ladies. Let your real eyebrows go back. I don't care if they look like this. When you're done, let them grow. You can shape them. You can shape your real eyebrows. Just don't use the fake one. Just don't draw them on no more. Because we ain't going to know if you a woman or a man. No more boob jobs. Out of here. Boob jobs are out of here. Let me go back to the hair. I'm going to tell y'all something, man. It's so many women with short hair that are just as beautiful as hell. It's no question if they are men. You can, if you a real woman and you cut your hair off, y'all saw Black Panther, y'all saw Wakanda, them bald head women, it was no question that they was women. Don't think that your hair being long de de determines your womanhood. It don't. I don't care if you got an egghead. I'm going to know that you a woman and you're going to look beautiful to me. That's the truth. That is the honest to God truth. It's time to go back to your natural selves. This don't have nothing to do with race. This don't have nothing to do with color. This don't have, you don't have to be light skinned no more. There's too many light skinned men that's dressing up, that's making themselves look like women. You don't have to be light skinned. You don't, that's, the, that's over with. You can be dark as, you could be purple black 
and be beautiful as hell because you are natural and we can distinctly tell as soon as we look at you that you are a 100% woman. The world has changed, man. Times are different. If your butt is perfectly round, like perfectly round, I'm scared. I'm scared. It better be shaped like a peach or an apple or some other type of fruit. It better be shaped different. It better can't it can't be shaped like this one or that one. Everybody like I want a butt like Nicki Minaj. No, you don't. I don't, I don't even like look. I don't even want to look at her butt. Cause I know it ain't real. It ain't nothing worse than a fake ass in the world today. Fake boobs, fake anything. Get out of here. Get out of here. If you fake, get out of here. And I ain't saying this to offend. If somebody want to go get their boobs done or their butt done, I'm not disrespecting you. But what that has done is that has put us in a situation, man, where any and everybody can become something they are really not. And there's nothing better to a heterosexual male than a beautiful 100% from birth to adulthood woman I'm not against women wearing makeup wear your makeup but don't paint your face don't go don't go Halloween with it it should be natural like I should be if you got makeup on I shouldn't be able to tell it's makeup until I'm deep into your eyes okay if I ain't deep into your eyes, then I shouldn't see no makeup. If I'm a, if I'm standing across, if I'm standing this far away from you, I shouldn't see no makeup. It should look natural. It should be just a hint here and a hint there. Too much of anything will get you not looked at. And if you're looking for a man, if you're a woman and you want a man, and you're looking for a husband, a man, not looking, I ain't saying y'all out here like, where's the man at? No. But if you're looking, if you want a heterosexual male to notice you, and if you want that attention back, and if you want to experience the attention that women used to get 15, 20, 10 years ago from having long hair, a lot of makeup, body parts like this and that, then go back to your natural self. That's what we are looking for. That's what heterosexual men are looking for. We cannot trust anything that is overdone. If you, if you look like a damn black Barbie doll or a white one, or any type of met a Puerto Rican, a Latino one, if you look like a Barbie doll, I have to question your authenticity. Period. But if you don't look like a Barbie doll, and if you look like who God made you to look like, I don't have any questions. I'm going to want to know what's in your mind. I'm going to want to get to know you better as a heterosexual male. Not me personally. I'm speaking for heterosexual males. But to make a long story short, y'all, that's my message to the ladies. Times are different. Go back to your natural self. If your hair's not long, if your hair's not pink, if it ain't blonde, if it ain't uh, brown, black, or whatever, if it's short, stop being uncomfortable with that. We can see the truth. 
we can see what's real. I would rather a bald head real woman than a full haired, big boob, big booty fake woman any day of the week. Because once you start falling for the fake, that's when you start, that's when these, that's how these men are coming in, playing the role as women, fooling heterosexual males. That's my message, man, to all you ladies. You can feel good now. You can take a break now. You can unwrap your hair. You can take these fake eyelashes off. You can stop putting so much lipstick on. Foundation. You know, you can take all the... You don't have to go out of your way to make yourself up anymore because at the end of the day, all of that making yourself up ain't going to do nothing but make you look like a man. It's over, girls, women, ladies. It's over. Let it go. It's your boy Chaney Live coming at y'all with another vlog. Yeah. We back, y'all. We going in. We speaking the truth. Some like it, some may not, but it's uh, it's divine, and uh, I don't know any other way to put it. But I love y'all, man. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Continue to be a part of this journey. We got a lot of great things coming, and I'm looking forward to having y'all there with me at the top, man. When we get there, it's your boy Chaney Live. I'm out.